I'm John Ritchie with Watson Marlowe. I wanted to address two common technical questions that we get around the Watson Marlowe 600 series of pumps. That includes this older 624 pump, the 620 pumps, and the newest 630 generation pumps. Any of these pumps that have the 620R or RE pump head that looks similar to this. These pumps all come brand new from the factory with a set of tubing clamps that are sized for the inner diameter of the tubing that you're using. These often get misplaced and they can be uh, purchased as a replacement kit from Watson Marlowe very inexpensively. Those clamps need to be in place. You can see where they are here and here. And if the incorrect size is in there, the pump won't pump at the correct pressure, and sometimes it won't pump at all. The other common issue that we get is the rollers are often not engaged. Here you can see the tubing roller. If you push this lever, the tubing roller pops out. That allows the roller to compress the tubing as the pump head is rotating. Pumps are stored like this and not come from the factory like that, and sometimes you don't realize that you need to engage the roller. It can be difficult with tubing installed to engage that roller, so once tubing is installed, it's easiest to rotate the head like this. The tubing is around this side. You can engage that roller rotate the head around, engage that roller. Once they're engaged and once these are sized to the ID of the tubing, the pump should work just fine. Any questions, post them below.